right guys i'm gonna show you how to install the ram mount onto the yamaha r3 all right guys so a quick video i uh, got a request from one of you guys so to install the ram mount when you buy the kit usually it's gonna be um, a startup kit that you can install to the stem of the forks but you can see on the r3 you can't so you have to kind of figure out other positions so i've seen other locations you can install it but for what i kept is this one right by the tank in front of the um or oh, right behind the forks and right in front of the tank uh, previously i had it installed right here it, it was okay but it was too much vibrations when i moved the the steering it was just moving too much so overall i decided to leave it around the center and that does not move at all it might vibrate a little bit but it's up to you guys if you want to keep it like that but for right now this is the pieces that i'm using to have this installed in front of the tank so you have to remove the bolt the stock bolt from there then you have to have use a washer below it the kit uh, ball joint on top of it then you have to put through a bolt i'll show you guys right here which bolt to use which washer to use and pretty much from there you just have to get the right uh, length um, i'll double check everything to see which length that i got but um if you get it too long it might be too too much but like previously i had a longer bolt that went right here but that one was a bit more difficult because to install it here you have to remove this bolt it goes all the way through so i have to remove the bottom bolt too and to keep it safe too i have to use washers on the bottom to keep this bracket on pretty much the clamp on tight onto the forks so that was too much for me so i like i said i ended decided to leave it running on a bike so it won't move too much and it'll be perfect so but you guys this is a good spot to use you could put it any place else if you want to but for me that's a pretty useful for me um but it's up to you guys it's uh, i have the phone strapped down so the phone won't fall off when this is on my phone it is a bigger phone now previously it was the s8 and the s9 it fit in here perfectly now with the s23 ultra it's kind of big so the straps won't be too too well it's gonna be way too tight it does go on but i i'm not gonna leave my phone on the bike because over time the vibrations do mess up the camera on the phone so because dude i got a new phone i'm not gonna put it on there all the time probably only if i need the gps or something but but you guys if you want like this content how i install this let me know in the comments below if this gonna helps you out if you have any questions let me know guys i'll try to help you out guys uh, but other than that subscribe guys we're gonna hit a thousand subscribers hopefully by the end of the year but all right guys it's gonna be a short video thanks for watching catch you next time peace